wild that pests can come from over irrigation and mowing your lawn too short. Here with me today is Master Gardener Debbie to tell us about one of those pests. How are you today? I'm, I'm great, Jana. Good. Thank I'm you so for letting me join you today. Awesome. I'm glad you're here. So what do we have right here? What is this? What's going this on with this grass? This is a piece of St. Augustine sod, which okay. is the most popular grass in Florida, but it's also popular to an insect, um, this chinch bug. Mm -hmm. They use their straw-like mouths to feed off your grass, wow. and they love the warmer weather and sunny locations. So is that why it's brown? Yes. It's starting okay. to turn a little yellow. When you have cinch bug damage, um, you get patchy areas of yellowish grass and they, it quickly turns brown and dies. Okay, so can we see them with our natural eye? What do they look like? Well, chinch bugs, they have three stages. They have okay. the egg stage where they start out, uh, they're just white and orange, and then they grow into nymphs. Okay. Um, they are they're small. Really yeah, they're very tiny. They start out red, they turn orange, and then black, and they hmm. begin to grow wings. Okay. Now, as adults, they grow to be about 3 16th of an inch. Wow. So, yes, they are very tiny. So, would we be able to see them when they're at that black stage? They look a little bigger. Um, I think the there will be a little bit bigger. And okay. That is one way you can tell if you do have cinch bugs. You can check, okay. you can get down on your hands and knees and look through the grass, okay. through the thatch layer, okay. and see if you can actually see the nymphs and the um, or the adults. Okay, so is that where they're feeding off the thatch layer here? Yes, they okay. love living in the thatch layer, so you want to make sure your thatch layer is no more than one inch thick. So we have identified that there's a problem. It's brown, we know we have chinch bugs, so what can we do to get rid of them, if we can? Oh, you can get rid of them. What you have to do is, if you only have a small area of chinch bug damage, you can, you can buy an insecticide, okay. which is specially made for chinch bugs, and mm. they have it there. Okay. And this is what it looks like, and you can spread it through around the areas that you have it. Okay. Now, if you have a large infestation, like if it's your whole lawn, you may want to hire a professional okay. to come out and assist with um, the spreading of these hazardous chemicals. Okay. And you must remember, if you are using a, chemi a chemical, you must rotate the mode of action okay. because if you use the same chemical over and over, the, they, the chinch bugs will become resistant to it. And they'll get used to it. Yes. Okay. Interesting. Wow. All right, so thank you so much. This is very interesting because um, I've always seen grass that looks brown like this but never knew why. You know, in mm -hmm. my mind, I'm thinking, oh, you need to water your grass, but definitely that may not be the case. So thank you so much for enlightening us and, and telling us about chinch bugs. Now you know what you need to do to keep your turf grass nice, beautiful, and green.